Hey, Killian. Good morning, dog. How about you start us off with a run, homie? Let's see it. Bird's eye. Here he comes. I set him up with a challenge to grind that wall right there. Now for today, it's going to take a while. We went looking at dirt bikes again. He hasn't gotten one yet, but his dad is focused on it. His mom is against it. Yeah. Hello, dudes. What's up? What's up, man? Oh, that's not the loser thing. Okay, how about the... Yeah. Uh, good morning. Um, it's a beautiful day today. It's going to rain cats and doggies out here. But again, the early bird gets the worm. I'm psyched. I'm fired up fired up about this I'm ready to get in there um, I got my pads today I got all my pads I got my favorite shirt I'll try to remember to turn that footage around so you guys can read it otherwise it would say um, mod if uh, freedom right freedom that would be mod ear <laughs> <laughs> Dad doesn't know what it is. I can't read it backwards. I'm looking at it backwards, but I can't read it backwards. Anyway, enough of that. We have a little rainwater from yesterday in the bowl. No problem. I'll just air out over it. Ah! Woo! Let's get it, dudes. Um, Wolfman, I believe, is going to meet us out here this morning. So that'll be a treat. I'm going to put any video I get so lucky to get of the wolfman on the endangered species channel i was hoping over on that channel i might be able to showcase some of the local talents we have out here the og talent right you got to be like an old guy uh, have we determined the og age um definitely i think over 40 but honestly for a prodigal son man i think it's just really kind of anybody that rediscovers that flame boom or gets it the first time you're right it's like, you're old, but yeah, you know, you're a badass anyway. <laughs> Some level of badassness that you want to come back. All right, there's Killy. Killy, take us in, dude. Go. See a run, dog. See if I can film him from like this. I'm going to fall in the bowl. I'm right on the coping here. Woo. Yeah. Right on, dude. Okay, let's get into this. Don't go too fast, dog. You never wind up. Oh, dude, he's going fast. I was nervous for you, bro. I didn't even follow you in. <laughs> I was nervous about that speed, Killy. <laughs> I know you you never took off that fast before, but you did good. Instead of fly out over the coping, you, you were able to stay low and in control. All right, let me follow you on this run now. I was like, I don't even feel comfortable following my boy on this one. I don't need to stress him out more. more likely to stick up there and not like fly up or fall down yeah sometimes it's it just it's just staying calm and not panicking you don't have to hit the top of the coping because you're going faster you just turn sooner i tried keeping him on camera i lost you on the deep end Let's do one more run like that and see if I can do better. Let's see if I can do better on the camera this time. Stay with him, Dad. Through the water, way to stay chill. Nice. I think I kept the camera on you the whole time. Look at this beautiful bowl, guys. This is really a beautiful bowl. A lot of you guys have been commenting about how this bowl has just about everything in it. And uh, it really does, man. 
We got a big old booby in the middle. We got a love seat right over there on the side. That's pretty sick. It does have concrete coping. That oververt, I'll tell you, whatever that looks like on camera, it's much, much taller than it looks. Trust me. Got a big uh, love seat up there. And uh, the coping here is, it's definitely six. Six and a half over there. Like, it feels taller than six, though, so it's a, it's a scarier six. Uh, it's the same deal. It's the same deal as yesterday, guys. I don't have to say it every video, do I? Take a look. Take a look. A66s. Someone asked me yesterday, I love these trucks. This is a fun setup. I love the Rock Handy. Let's be honest. The gear doesn't make all that much of a difference. That's keeping it real. Size makes a difference, right? Because that's what she said. Go over there. Boom, let's get a run, my first run. All right. Tidal wave, man. It's off in the distance. The energy is starting to rise. It's time for me to hit that a little harder. I've got pads today. I'm tired. That was a comment from yesterday as well. Hold on. Maybe a young guy. Maybe a super fit guy. Not super fit. Anyway, that was my second run. And honestly, I was approaching the coping here almost with an intention to go for it. Deep breath. Stay calm. Get some water. Yeah, I need to get some water. All right, dudes. Let's get in some speed. Let me turn up the volume just a tad. How about beast mode level two? They come off? I felt like that time I went up a little higher. I really feel like the key to this is getting the cojones under you to get higher up on that wall. Boy, that takes a little bit of effort in your mind. All right, let me give it one more try. Let me give a real honest try to get up like one inch higher. <laughs> let me give an honest try to get up five inches higher. And maybe I'll get two inches out of that. All right, homies. Today's Sunday. Thanks for watching. 
I'm gonna take you out with this last run. This will be my first backside air attempt. Hip hop over the hip. First drop in of the day too. Okay, ready bud? So my footing's been off, and my lineup on the hip has been off, and I feel like my angle's been off. But I gave it a little more effort that time, so let's do that again. Okay, ready? Guys, should I hit the B switches? It's been a long time. Okay, one more. Now that I'm engaging B switches. All right, here it is. Should I give it a little growl? Let's break out the growl. Nine two five, black label OG bars, A sixty six trucks, bones bushings hard, murdered out, all black. No stock washers. If you guys are using stock washers with the bones, you don't need them. All right, and I've got rock candies in blue. Very hard, very nice. For as hard as they are compared to the bones, um, like the Tony Hawk wheel, or I feel like they're more grippy. Is that true? You can have that with a PB&J sandwich. I don't know. I feel like it's more grippy, therefore making me feel better on the board. I have like five sets of those bones. What are they, the 104 or the 84B or whatever they are? And I don't write any of them. All right, dudes. So I'm gonna try doing something a little different here on this hip. For the hip pop, I'm gonna come in slower and lower, but I'm gonna try to incorporate a little ollie right at the bottom of this thing. If I can get comfortable with the movement, then I can start to gradually go up and up and up a little bit. That way I don't feel like I need to boost so much speed to try to get up off the ground, but I can get more into the flow of actually popping it some. Take us out, Killy. Bye, homies. <laughs> right on, dudes. Hey, thank you for your comments yesterday. Um, hearing you guys, many of you guys, uh, appreciate the videos the way you do, asking me to keep doing them. Man, that makes a huge difference. The comments make a huge difference. I mean, 
you guys like fully energized me yesterday to stay on it, you know? Okay, so there was a comment about a moto vlog and you know, what, what do I mean? I'm gonna slap a GoPro on my helmet and try to do a wheelie again after six years or eight years or, God, dude. It's probably been 10 years since I've busted a wheelie on there. But you know what? Moto vlog for me is some wheelies. <laughs> so, uh, but that's not gonna become the root of the channel anymore. I'm not changing the content. I'm a skater. I'm gonna be a skater forever. Endangered species, a prodigal son. All right, we love you. We love you. We love you. Peace out, homies. Oh, <laughs>